Dell Inspiron 5570 upgrade to SSD. Let's open the back cover first. This laptop has some hinge problem and broken plastic in inside this area. Maybe the hinge is broken or the plastic studs are broken. Let's check. The screw is not getting out. Finally got it out. This is a 8th generation i5, so we can install a NVMe SSD into it. can just gently pry it out it should pretty easily come off it's very easy to remove the screen this has a NVMe slot here so we can just install a NVMe here on, in this slot so now let's proceed with that initially we have to install all the OS in the SSD so we'll disconnect the hard drive first so that the first boot device will be the SSD Let's remove the hard, hard drive connector from here that should be sufficient I think here we'll be installing a 256 SSD NVMe let's remove the retention screw Just plug SSD in the slot. It's that easy. That was pretty much it. We have disconnected the hard drive cable. So now we'll proceed with the windows 10 installation this had windows 10 professional so we'll restore the license accordingly here i have a windows 10 flash drive i will be installing the license from the original pen drive this laptop came with home and it was upgraded to professional fpp license so the customer had a media for the device the installation has started I'll just fast forward the windows installation and continue after the installation now the windows 10 Pro has been installed. Let's shut down the machine. We'll again replug the original hard drive. That's it. The hinges look fine from here. So there is no need to repair or replace the hinge. Just pack up the machine now. 
you know just fix all the screws can see the SSD is installed and the other hard drive partitions are as it is. The OS is now on the NVMe SSD. It's a 256 GB NVMe SSD. Thank you for watching.